Hey guys, Crystal here at Crystal's Crafties. Today we're going to talk about the new text editing features in Cricut Design Space. So let's pull in some text just like we normally would. Okay, let's try this out. So here is the new text box that Cricut has given us. It looks a little different. We have some new handles and we've gotten rid of some features. You can see there's no longer an X to delete this. Um, and there's no longer a way to rotate that you can see right off the bat. So let's talk about those two things to begin with. If I wanna delete this, I can either come up here and click delete or I can hit the backspace button on a desktop and that goes away. Okay, let's talk about what I do, what I do if I wanna rotate this. So if you hover over your handles here, you can see that you would be able to expand it, but there's no way to rotate it. Scroll out just a little bit and you're gonna get this curved arrow. Now you can click and drag and rotate just like you would previously. Okay, let's talk about what these other handles do. So if we come down here to this one, it works just the same as always. It scales larger and smaller. If we come up here to this one, it doesn't change the size of our text any, but it makes our text box bigger. And the same thing if we do this. It's not changing the size of our text any. All I have accomplished here is making my text box bigger. I'm gonna hit Control Z, get rid of all that. If I want, get rid of all that. If I want to make my text larger, I have to scroll, I have to use my scale here or come up here and change my font size. But what if I want to just change the height of my letters? I don't want it to be any wider. Let's say this is, what is this? 9.43 in width, and I want it to be three inches tall, but I don't want to change this width any at all. Well, obviously this isn't going to get that done for me. And there's no way to unlock it down here anymore. That little lock is gone. It's up here. It's always been up here, but it's still up here. You've been able to do it from down there and up here. Now your only choice is up here. So I wanna leave my width exactly the same and I wanna make it three inches tall. So hit the three and now you can see it just got taller, but it didn't get any wider. This is where you will lock and unlock your text from now on. It won't have the lock down here in the corner anymore. Okay. Something else that they have added in is a text wrap or Cricut's version of a text wrap. If you take your handle and you squish it in, it's going to start giving you additional lines of text. So now you can see I've got these three lines of text here and they are center justified. Make this a little smaller so y'all can see it. Um, you can come up and you can left justify and you can write justify, but when you start wrapping text, Cricut will automatically put it into the center justified position. If you don't want this text wrap, you wanna go back to your single layer of text, just click alignment and turn off that text wrap and it goes back to your single layer of text. Previously to get separate lines, you would have to come in here and click and hit the enter key after every word that you wanted to separate out. But we no longer have to do that. We can control every bit of that with just the handles that they have given us. So let's start this again. I'm gonna pull back up to 100% here. Text, um, let's do this again. Okay, so here's my text box. To be able to edit it, you have to first click out of it and then you can edit. I'll show you what I mean. So I've clicked on the text tool over here. While it is highlighted, I start typing my text. Oops. Now, I can keep typing, but I can't edit anything yet until I click out of anywhere on the white. Just click out of your text box and now you will be able to edit your text. You can click in 
and you can add things if you want. I can you know, delete things, add things in, whatever it is I want to do. And then I can use my handles to edit and expand things however I want them to be. Um, I can rotate by dragging out and getting my rotates, or I can use the actual rotate up here as well too. I can put it to 90 degrees. I can put it back to zero degrees. If I need to unlock and lock my scale, I'm gonna do it from up here now. And if I need to delete what I have, I'm either going to hit the delete up here in the right hand corner, or I'm going to hit the backspace button. So those are the new text features that Cricut has introduced. We'll see you next time.